Welcome to the Ashley Schiff Woods. This little gem is 22 acres on the Stony Brook campus. And these trails unite Somos with main campus and the hospital with main campus. As you walk through this woods, you can the first thing maybe you could notice is the understory. It's not particularly tall. It's two feet, maybe three feet, and it's almost all the same plant. The plant is the maple leaf viburnum. That's it. The leaves are shaped like maple leaves. The maple leaf viburnum is globally rare, and even rare in the Northeast. Places where it thrives, it's getting eaten by beetles. Not in our woods. That fern, I'm, I'm using iNaturalist to identify. There are three kinds of ferns that live in Ashley Schiff. That one is a cinnamon fern, and it's named that because in the fall it sends up a stringer that's cinnamon colored. Other ferns are the New York fern, the hay-scented fern, and also the sensitive fern. As I'm walking through the forest, I like to look at the things on the ground. I like to see the winter green and the blueberries and the lichen that are remnants from when this place used to be under a glacier. And it still has tundra flowers in here, tundra plants. I also like to identify plants I don't know. I did not know what that was when I stopped and used iNaturalist to identify it. Turns out it's a common hair cap moss. And like the cinnamon fern, it's native to Long Island. And that's in fact one of the nicest things about Ashley Schiff Woods is that most of the plants and animals you see are in fact native. Both the ferns and that moss, they prefer it in high heat and high humidity. They like it where it's wet. As you're walking, See if you can spy what the soil looks like. It's one way you can tell this is in a Pine Barrens. If you were to pick up that soil and let it drip through your fingers, you would see that although there is sand, it's not primarily sand. If you go to the Pine Barrens, you'll find lots of sand. If you took Bio 204 and you were walking through this woods, you might have thought to turn over some of those logs that are laying on the ground and look for isopods. You can find them there. The other thing you can find under there are earthworms. I'm always a fan of the earthworms. Recently, in Ashley Schiff Woods, we've been finding very vigorous earthworms that are super large and very active. Their common name is the crazy snake worm because they wiggle so much when you pick them up. They're newly arrived from Asia. But all worms on Long Island are non-native because any place that used to be under a glacier has no native earthworm species. The earthworms that you would normally find in Ashley Shove come from Europe. 